In the previous tutorial, we looked at how to trigger a lookup and how we can filter the results directly in the lookup dialog box. In this tutorial, we will demonstrate how that type of filter can also be triggered using data present in fields on your app. We need to make small changes to the connect and search command properties. We will first uncheck the search checkboxes in the send parameters section because we no longer want to use this type of search filtering. Do be aware that we could use both filter methods concurrently if we wanted to. Next, we will link the send parameter last name directly to the last name field on the app. Click in the source field for the parameter you want to use. That's all we do to change from a pop-up dialog search filter to a filter in a field on the app. When we preview the app, we can type in our short name search parameters in the last name field and then trigger the lookup as before. The main difference is that the filter options at the top are no longer available and the filtered list displays without pressing the search option button first. We select the field required as before. While we have demonstrated this alternative filter method using the same lookup used in a previous tutorial, this method would also be applicable for most other connections, some of which are seen in other tutorial videos.